Hello, Morris Fisher from MorrisFisherBlog.com. Today I uh, was reading some statistics that were kind of revealing. One is that uh, by the year 2020 or 24, I think it was, 40% uh, of the American population will be self-employed. And I was listening also to another statistic uh, from Stats Canada. And uh, they reported that there was a 100% increase in the people who were declaring themselves as self-employed. Now, what does this mean? The way that I got it figured is that, uh, one, there's been a lot of people laid off and they are setting up cons uh, consulting and uh, businesses on their own. And uh, that means that, uh, that after every recession, there is an increase in the number of people that go into business for themselves. And uh, these people will need, and I would imagine that they are over the 40 uh, age group, and they've got a lot of experience and have uh, got a lot of, uh, of expertise under their belt because they've lived. And th then I was also talking about uh, to some kids, well, kids to me, uh, 40 and under, and uh, particularly one, I went to the school and they have a uh, program called uh, Video Arts or uh, Theater Arts, I guess it's called. And they're learning uh, how to do uh, PowerPoints, how to do videos, how to film, how to edit, uh, how to write, uh, keyword research, uh, and they are really have the skills. And most kids, particularly in high school, uh, take this course and uh, they have got some really marketable skills I wish that I had uh, when I was going into business. So my thinking on this is that if we could get these two groups together, one with the skills but don't know what to do with them and they believe that they don't have a marketable skill, which they do, hook up with somebody in this older age group that has the experience and could become a mentor to them. Uh, for an example of this, I have a friend who is in video arts and uh, him and I have hooked up on uh, video uh, making. He's going to do the, the, <coughs> the editing and uh, the filming and so on and so forth and he told me that uh, he has to go to uh, theater art school uh, at university to get accredited and I said whoa you can do this you have a marketable skill already that other people will pay for your expertise and this kid is only 20 years old so in my coaching uh, we're going to try this thing out and we'll let you know how, how it works. But to me, with this recession and the downturn in the economy and there is a lot of people left off and uh, let go and there's a lot of people that are the younger that they don't know where they're going to get a job so they are going to be uh, looking for a job and they don't even know that they've got uh, a marketable skill. And some of the work that I have seen has been great. So, to my mind, uh, this is where the network king has to go. I've been to several uh, live events and I find that most of the people there are 40 and above. So how are we going to replace and how are we going to bring these young people into our business, whether it's network marketing, whether it is uh, skill development, whether it is an MLM, it doesn't really matter. This is the future and these kids are looking for something to do other 
than a job. So hope that you were interested in this and uh, this is Morris Fisher from morrisfisherblog.com wishing you living life abundantly.